All right, hi everybody. It's Vault Guy 22. I'm really happy, really, really happy. Though I got a live stream, I got to tell some grim news about the live stream. But before that, this video needs to come out, and I just got to tell everyone: expect this week and next week two unboxings. One for anime and one for manga. Oh my god! Let me just say right now, what I guys got to show you. Next week is like a double, double whammy of manga. It's, it's special. It's special. That's all I have to say about that. But anyway, beside the point, this props go out to, I think this guy, <laughs> I'm not sure this sub. Um, let me find his name because he, um, he gave me this message about this news of the reveal of the title for the next, for this, um, Attack on Titan spin-off manga. Um, so, he gave me that news, I think it was, when did he send me this? Let me see. This was sent to me, fuck, where is it? Ah, here we go. Uh, August 20th, 2013, and he, is, he basically gives uh, props with props to do, Shinnizuma. This guy, I think this guy has two accounts. This is the, I think this is the same guy who's A.G. Nezima. But I'm not sure. There's two Nezimas. Go figure. But this news, Bankai Night 22's manga news... Well, it should be anime manga news, but I'm just going to call it manga news. Title released for Attack on Titan spinoff manga. Now, the logistics of this manga is simple. I personally like it. I don't know what Justin's going to do, McWorpling. I don't know what he's going to say about it, but this is what I have to say about it. I think it's a great idea. Like, for real. Basically, and I'll read it off here, and I'll put in the link description below of this article. Of this. It's the full article. A lot of information to absorb in this article. But I'll give you the 411 on it. Basically, the name of the manga is going to be called... Before the Fall. Now, Before the Fall is a light novel. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I'm surprised too. It was a light novel that came out, from what I understand, the same time, or at least close to the same time as Shingeki no Kyoji. Now, the logistics of the light novel were that they were cre it was created by this guy um, Ryo Suzukaze, um, and basically the, before that they, they they talk about you know who's it says an insert of the second Blu-ray disc of Attack on Time revealed that Satoshi Shiki, the one who did Daphine in the Brilliant Blue, Kamikaze, and Riot will draw the attack on time before the fall spin-off manga. And saying the series will premiere in the monthly Shonen series magazine October issue on uh, August 26. See, Shiki, and, that, and then it goes on to say, Shiki released, announced earlier the month that he was ending the X-Blade manga and launching a new series in the October issue. Now, because I'm not sure if I can link you guys, this guy's manga, X-Blade. I don't know if I can do that, because I might get copyright issues. So, I'll just link this article. This article. And it goes on to say what this Before the Fall is about. Basically, Before the Fall is before. 3D Maneuverable Gear. And it says, The manga is adapting Ryo Suzukaze's light novel series of the same name, and it's going to be done... The, 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 the This was done by the artist who did Trinity Blood. Thor's... Thor's... Shibamoto. 
he provided illustrations for these novels. And this is the first novel shipped in 2011, and the third novel shipped in June 2012. And it says the story of the light novel series takes place before Hajime Asayama's original manga and follows Anhiru. Hopefully I'm saying that name right. Anhiru. A member of the Survey Corps who works <coughs> in weapons development. Anhiru is tired of seeing the corpses of his fellow Survey Corps members and is working to design equipment that will allow humans to be able to kill Titans. Thus far, listen to this people, this is, this is crazy. Thus far, no one has been able to find out the weak point of the Titans and so no one has managed to kill one. However, government conservatives think that fighting against Titans is unnecessary and orders ordered the dissolution of the Survey Corps. Oh man, that that alone had me like went over right in my head. Because here's the way I look at it. Before the fall is probably more barbaric than Attack on Titan. Hey, I call it like I see it. But that's the way I look at it, people. It's probably more bar barbaric. Because think about it. They don't have the gear. They don't, they don't have the gear. They don't have the weak point. <laughs> they don't have the weak point of the Titans in this series. So you're going to see a lot of fucking... You're going to see a lot of corpses. A lot of... Oh, my God. I can you imagine. Oh, I'm, I'm really psyched. I'm really psyched for this series. Now... Good news comes out in October. The reason that's the good news is, let me tell you right now, once the anime is over, everyone's hopping on that manga. And look, here comes another one. This is going to go alongside it. So you're not just going to get me doing Attack on Titan chapter reviews. Oh, you know I'm reviewing this. So, at least to say this is a huge news Huge events. I can't believe this is going to go down. Now, surprisingly, Shin Nizuma, and Shin Nizuma, I, I got your message about this and read the article and everything else, so good props on you. He was saying that this guy, Anhiru, Anhiru, I can't even say his correct name. I can't say his name. It's a hard to say. Reminds him of Guts. And I was like, huh? It confused me. I was like, it didn't click on me of what he meant by that. But, at least to say, that's the story. Uh, the other set, side of this article basically is just saying, Asayama's original manga depicts the battle between humans and giants who rule the world outside of human walls and caves. Uh, and, uh, yeah. So this, this, this novel actually came out, you know, two years after Attack on Titan. Because Attack on Titan was beginning to see, uh, see how launched it, uh, and uh, Shonen Mag Basatsu Shonen Magazine in 2009. So, yeah, that's the story. Also, I, I know this has nothing to do with this 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 spinoff. I took a look on Amazon. They already have on Amazon Volume Twelve. I, I, I was like, wait a minute, that doesn't make any sense. You, you can't have volume 12 coming out in April, right? That's what it said. April 2014, volume 12. I was like, what? That's impossible. But sure enough, it was there. I just shake my head because I'm realizing what's happening here. I'm realizing the hype of Attack on Time, Shigeki no Kyoji, is getting so insane that the people who who translate and deliver the manga, yeah, and bring it to stores, these bad katocha, they are going in. Listen, I think all manga publishing companies should learn to think too from them. This is how you do manga. You bring it out. Just like that. So, this is exciting. New manga, new spin-off series. Also, props, props to do. 
Shinezuma, good shit. I love it. I love the idea. I support this spinoff. Um, so it's going to start in October. This should be interesting. I'm going to get a double dose. Going to get Shingeki no Kyojin in October. And then you're going to get this. So we will see how it goes. It should be more brutal. I, I, I personally think it's going to be more barbaric than Attack on Titan. Because you got to wonder. They don't know what the, weakness, the weak spot of the Titans are in this manga. And they do not have the gear. So this, I, at least I think, don't quote me on that. I think they don't have the gear. So, but we have to wait and see. Um, and this should be interesting. This should be interesting. Um, and then the other thing is like, this is all good. No one's killed a Titan. Nobody. Nobody has killed a Titan. So, the only thing about this manga that I'm questioning where it takes place. At what time period? How long ago from the beginning of Attack on Titan with Eren and all that stuff does this take place before the fall? Personally, I have no idea. I have no clue. Personally, I have no clue. I'm going to take a whack and say... I'm not going to say a hundred years. But I'm going to say that it was a good amount of time before then. That's what I think. But yeah, that's the story, people. I'll put the article. Oh, so much shit. Oh, man. Today was a, a whirlwind. You know? Got this news. I was looking on Amazon. Oh, by the way, you should not be surprised. I pre-ordered pretty much the whole fucking catalog of Attack on Titan. Eight. Nine. Ten. So the only one I didn't pre-order was eleven. So, you know I'm going in on this. So yeah, that's the story, people. Bonkai Night Toy 2. See you guys later. King of Titans, let's go. This manga is going to be sick. It's going to be sick. They don't know the weak spots of the Titans. And no one's killed a Titan before. <laughs> you know? No one's killed a Titan before. I was like, yo, that's crazy. And you know what I like the best part of this article? And you'll see it when you take a look at it. The government wants to disband the survey squad. That's awesome. That's blown away. I'm blown away. Hey, I don't give a shit. Hey, I'll be biased as much as I want. I love this fucking show. I love this manga. Look. So, yeah. Oh, by the way, I'm not going to tell you what I bought. The manga, the extra manga I bought. But next week, you'll see. It's, it's a doozy. It's a doozy. But, yeah, that's all I got for you guys. Ball can I do too. I'll see you guys later. Attack on Titan, the motherfucking moon! Let's go! Let's go! Peace. See ya.